Guess who got a job? Guess who got a job? Look at her. In training. Uh, <laughs> did you know I said that? Yeah, she uh, does. Your friend work today? Yeah. Uh, I don't gotta go today. Why you got your clothes on then? I'll turn it on with the shoes. And look at her. She went and got some sketchers. Look, she bougie. We told her to go to Walmart. No, <laughs> and she got bougie. My friend. He worked at Texas Rock. What is you doing to your neck, Deja? <laughs> what? I'm trying to fix it. Stop. Jump. Right. <laughs> right, jump. Like... Right, jump. Right, jump. Take me. Anyway, this girl went to Famous Footwear and bought some $90 shoes. Yeah. That because I have complications with my feet. <laughs> so. <laughs> I told her to go to Walmart <laughs> like everybody else. But so she what? looked cute, y'all. No. Stand up, Deja, so they can see the whole oh. outfit. She looks oh. cute. Yeah, that's like the best uniform like of the fast food places. It's just so plain and simple. I mean, the rest is plain and simple. But I need to be a fly on the wall to see Deja. Oh, talking to people? Yes, like talk, interacting. and Y'all yeah. know how she is. She is so raw and blunt, like oh, Deja. Dude. You have to... Huh? You are? <laughs> but she, you gotta wait a little. You gotta probably gotta wait a couple days. Do you know if you're gonna be doing drive through or? Yeah. You do yeah. drive through, the expo, like people outside. You yeah. clean the counters and stuff, yeah. and you do register. Let me take that back. Because, yeah, she she be the sweetest, most polite child. You would you would think she have some manners when I she's. I do. No, yes, not, do. Not, not, with not with us. You. It's your family. <laughs> No, seriously though, when she's out and about interacting with other people, it's a different Deja. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I had to take that back though. Do what you just did. What? Yeah, that's cute. Yeah, I like that. I was doing this style yesterday with the two pigtails. Oh, my mm -hmm. style. They, okay, yeah, your style. I did it, I did it, did it and then style. she did it. And now you're did she, oh. she did. Why you don't put yours up? Because I can't keep it like that. Mine's Why? Mine's short. And Chanel. <laughs> Chanel, y'all, you hear Chanel, y'all at the door? Like, uh, she always do that. That's, really That's her way of knocking. She really always do that. Mm -hmm. Hello. Yeah. Don't do that. Rip up my pants. Sometimes it be so loud. I'm thinking somebody's baby doing like that. Like, really? Oh she be that her little yeah. butt be that loud? Yes. It's like she like go up and do like this. I don't know. You don't do that, do you? Don't they lying on you? Yeah, she literally always do that. Like it'd be so loud, I'd be seeing somebody bang at my door. I'd be like, what the? And then she be seeing a little shadow at the bottom, a little foot. Like, oh and then she just come in here. Mm -hmm. And where does she sleep? She come in here and go to sleep. Yeah, she jump on there, jump on my bed, you go to sleep. Uh, Sometimes like she can pull up the spot for some reason. <laughs> She got a little routine. <laughs> yeah, literally. Now, Deja, why you say you won't put your hair up? But it's two forty-one. I thought she said she had to work today. What? Oh. So if I was to put mine up like that, it would be skimpy, like on the sides. You see how much you got on the sides? Yeah, that's cute. Yeah, I got like way more. Yeah. And plus, it's fuller. You know, your hair thicker than mine. Deja had a headband on yesterday and it was looking cute. But this is her um, progress because I know she ain't did no videos of or nothing. Y'all are a little bit over two months in, right? You got them in April? Um, April, yeah. June. I got mine April 3rd. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. I was telling y'all I was two months yeah, in. Like, no, you're like one, yeah. Because they was like asked. Right. See, y'all, they were sitting up there. When you go, what? You supposed to get your hair retwisted. Da, 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 da. I'm like, I ain't had them that long, but I was telling them two months. Nah. Some people don't get retwisted like six months. Right. Because she was like, you supposed to get them retwisted every month. I'm every like, nah, I don't. Some people don't do that because you really can. 
like cause problems. Yeah. Yeah, but it just depends on you. Okay. Yeah, but some people. Yeah, but when she used the word suppose, that's what threw yeah. me off because yeah. you're not yeah. supposed yeah. to do nothing. Uh -huh. Yeah, because I remember when I first got it, a lot of people was like, yeah, I don't do get mine done to like six to eight weeks. Yeah. Deja hair thick too. I like her ends is cute no they're nice and why you always do that to are. yourself i literally thought they were no they're split uh, yeah you see this one see how it's like two things yeah yeah but like at the end they're not split so how do you fix that i don't know, I don't know. what y'all think she should do y'all because yeah. it's a lot of people who got locks out there you never really pay attention until you got some, you know, a hairstyle or like a car or something. You never really pay attention yeah, into something. Babe, I see my car all the time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, or I see that car that I wanted, the Mini Cooper, mm -hmm. all the time. <laughs> Literally all the time. Yeah. Like, I need you to be quiet. Like, please, please. She hiding under there for a reason. Get away from you. Like, <laughs> she's under here so irritating. But look at her. <laughs> that soft bite. Jay said, Thank you. Are you going, Deja? Yeah. All right, they about to roll out. So I'm about to record a video, y'all. I'm about to do um, a cumulative, if that's what you call it, a cumulative haul. Are you talking about like a lot of stuff? Yeah, that I accumulated yeah. over time. Where do you say call it? I don't know. It's not accumulated. It's something else. It'd be like, Oh my, it's called something. I forgot. Collective? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Collective. Yeah, okay, yeah. a collective haul. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm about to do. What's up, y'all? I know y'all seen me earlier today because I went live. I wasn't even going to vlog today because I wasn't really going to be doing nothing but busy packaging orders. Cleveland and the kids helped me, so I got done early. I know y'all like, why is she in the doggone refrigerator? I was looking for something to eat, and I don't feel like cooking anything. Earlier when I was live, I was eating on a uh, um, pot pie that I didn't even finish. So I'm still hungry. I might just warm this up while you're playing. So I still have a lot of the pie pie left. So yeah, I'm about to warm this up. Eat on my little cutie. And I'm gonna do a collective haul for y'all. Yeah, I have to say this again. I appreciate y'all for the support. Well, I put some eye drops in my eyes called Blink Contacts. Say dry contacts, lubricating eye drops, moisturizes, dry lenses. It says instantly moisturizes, and that it did do. Let me eat on this a little bit. I should have lit my candle back there. Gave it a little vibe in here. I might go do that. Don't YouTubers be having a candle burning in the background? And they do like content video. <laughs> anyway, y'all, after I do this, Probably about to run to Sephora. I'm gonna get him some cologne for Father's Day. Cleveland has bad allergies, so he can't just wear like any cologne. I want him to smell this Chanel cologne. It seemed like everybody was recommending that one. Yeah, I need him to smell it and make sure it's good. Yeah, he likes it. Let me hurry up before this battery dies. So where should we start? I got a little collective haul going on here. I, I'm gonna need to change this battery because it ain't gonna let me be great. I guess I'll show y'all the purses first since that's what I have the most of. I got this one, it's Love Machino. It's a crossbody. It got two zippered compartments. The inside is this pretty red color. I love the gold hardware. I got it at TJ Maxx for $89. Next, I got two coach purses. These are the little vanity. Purses? These are the little vanity purses. I think that's what they call them. This one was $140 and this one was $89. This one is black with the gold hardware. Got the tag on the side. And then this one is red with the silver hardware. And then you just open it up like that. And that's what the inside looks like. The inside is the same, this like maroon burgundy color on the black one as well. I think they're so cute. This cute Minnie Mouse lounge fly backpack. Like it is so freaking cute. This came out last week sometime. I wasn't gonna get it. And Naya was like, it is so cute. You better get it cause you know it's gonna sell out. So I was like, okay, I'll go ahead and get it. If y'all don't know, I like to collect lounge fly backpacks. I probably won't wear it but it's so freaking cute and different. So I was like, let me go ahead and get it. I went back on Lounge Fly and it was sold out. So I'm so glad I got it. That's what it looks like in the inside. The straps are in there as well. You can also wear this as a crossbody or a backpack. 
Dillard's was having a good sale. I picked up this Coach Tote. So cute, right? This is part of the Keith Herring collection. When this collection came out, like I didn't get anything. I know it's like the old, old school Mickey, but I don't really like the way he looked. So I didn't pick up anything from the collection when it came out, but I do like this. It has the tag here. And the inside is this pretty like suede caramel color. That's the inside. Dillard's were having a sale. I got this for $179 and now it's back to like $300. So I was like, glad I snatched it up when I did. So I finally got my Gucci backpack from DH Gate in. Just look at that. I forgot what the name of this backpack is called, like the official name. First, some of y'all remember I went in the Gucci outlet last month or a couple months ago seen this backpack and I'm like, oh, I want it. I fell in love with it, but I didn't fall in love with the price, which was almost $2,000. So your girl went on DH gate. It was kind of hard to find. And um, here we are. Now this is one of the most expensive bags that I purchased on DH gate. This one and the one that I'm about to show you, this one was $165. I don't think I've ever paid more than $80 for a bag on DH gate. Like, look at that. And then this the back. Everything feels good, not cheap. We've got the padded straps. This is padded. I did stuff it. Now, when the seller shipped it, they didn't have it stuffed. So I kind of stuffed it because I didn't want it to be bent out of shape. Now, it wasn't bent out of shape when it got to me, but I didn't want it to, you know. So this is what the inside looks like. Yeah, it's really nice in there. Cause you can put your phone, your wallet, thing like easy access right there. So this is the best $165 that I done spent. Then I got this bad boy. Hey. I instantly fell in love with this bag at the Gucci outlet. This one I originally went on DH Gate to look for. And then the same seller was selling that bag. And this one was a little more. This one was $198. This is what it looks like up close. On the original, it's uh, different colors like that. And the back is the same, got the padded straps. And then this is padded as well. The inside, it's the same kind of lining. I am really satisfied with both of these backpacks. Now I cannot leave the link to the backpack because I get in trouble. Okay, moving on to the, uh, we'll do an accessory since they right here. I got a coach bag charm it's so cute it's a lock and key i think it was like 25 dollars on the coach outlet and you can actually put it in there like so it's so cute so cute and then from michael kors online i got this little jewelry tray it was on sale for like i want to say 29 dollars. they had a smaller one as well so yeah, just a jewelry tray. I'm gonna set it right here and put the jewelry I wear the most in there. Or I might put it over here on my um, stand. And I got some scarves from DH Gate, Louis Vuitton scarves. Good quality. I think the scarves was, uh, I wanna say like $12. $12. These are originally $250 to $300. I mean, they cute, but I can't pay no $200, $300 just for no scarf. That's gonna get gel all over it. Cause that's what I'll probably only use it for, like a head scarf, like that or whatever. I, I know some people put it on their bag to wrap around the handle or whatever. I probably won't do that. That's just not my style. And then I got this black, white, and gold one. Then I got this one. All of the scarves only took about two weeks. The backpacks took a little bit over a month. This is what this one looks like. Yeah, I'm satisfied with them, $11. Has the little tag on there. Got this tag. Lastly, from the accessories, I got this Louis Vuitton bracelet. That's what it looks like. It just, this is the one that got the bag on the end. This on the Louis Vuitton website is like $390, if I'm not mistaken. 
but this one was only like $25. <laughs> That's what it looks like. It even has Louis Vuitton in the inside. Uh oh, it's not gonna focus right. Yeah, it's a date code, say Louis Vuitton, and then it says made in Spain. You can see that. It has you know, Louis Vuitton right there. This is what it looks like. On. Moving on to the shoes. Now I got these Nike Dunks, the Ben and Jerry's from DH Gate. These were like $90. Like these are dope to me. I don't care. <laughs> these are so dope to me. Look at the back. Like I said, these are the Ben and Jerry's. Uh oh. Like, it's the quality of these shoes are A1. They came in this box. It had a stock X tag on it. Because you can get these on stock X for like six hundred to eight hundred dollars. Stock X little decal. It came with extra shoe strings. I will be switching out the white ones. The white ones doesn't make the shoe pop. So I'll be switching out to either the green ones or the yellow ones. Probably the yellow ones. Yeah, I'll probably switch out to the yellow ones. And that's what the green look like. Ninety dollars. Now these took about two and a half months. Okay, I got some Gucci slides. Now these are authentic Gucci slides. I ordered them on the Gucci website. And I'm thinking about taking these back. I think they were like $3.90. I love the colors. Maybe I need to get an outfit to go with them and then I'll see. I got three days left before I can return these. So they just been sitting in my corner uh, ever since I purchased them. But I like them, but the black ones, I think I can get more wear out of them. I only got a few more items. I got the SpongeBob Vans, which are so cute. That on the side, I like the bottom. Now this one has plankton on the bottom. Yeah, these are just really dope to me. So I picked these up. I love Vans. Don't care too much for SpongeBob, but the shoe is dope to me. So I got the SpongeBob socks because I thought they were so cute. And then I picked up the SpongeBob shirt. Now I will wear this shirt with the shoes. Just has SpongeBob creeping up out of the pocket there. Got plankton over there. And then on the back, got SpongeBob, the checkered, and Vans. That's all I got. This was one of the colognes that they, I ain't gonna be recording much in here because of music. It's Okay, I just right back tried back. this Versace and I like this one better than the Chanel. You like that one? Yeah, it's not straight. You can smell it. This one. You just uh, tried. You just recommended this one, Spice Bomb. This smells okay, but it seemed like more of a fall scent to me. Like you would wear it at the fall, during the fall time. Curious of what that is. Oh, okay. This is the one that you didn't like. This one, uh, uh, the first time it's like kind of shocked, but mm -hmm. when he settled down, it's like very, um, like, um, how to say that? Um, <laughs> what do I want to say, beach walk? Yeah. Okay. Um, the line is unisex. Okay. So, anyone can use it. I like this one. It's like kind of some blood. It's like that, that feeling when yeah. you... When you ever home from the beach, it's like yeah, <laughs> this smells good. Bahamas yeah, or something. yeah. You said it smells like the Bahamas, right? Let me have him try this one. This one's called Coffee Break. Coffee uh, Break. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you want to walk around smelling like coffee and like Starbucks. Yeah, it's like coffee and uh, yeah. caramel. Caramel and vanilla. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that bottle look cute. <laughs> Say one million. I care about the bottle. Yeah, shoot, sure, the bottle was part of it. <laughs> to me, standard, well, for females, yeah, that smells good. Which one was that? The gold, So, yeah. this one smells good. This beach walk is $135 under the lemon trees, bubble bath. Oh, they don't even have that one to uh, test. Replica, okay. Thank you, thank you, you too. Y'all, look at the iMac colors. I want this one, the green one. 
The yellow one look kind of good too though. Like all of them is pretty. I don't know if I told y'all, but I did have it pre-ordered and I canceled it because <laughs> after I thought about it, my total came up to like 2,500. Since I edit with mine, I need a lot of storage. So I had to, you know, add storage and everything. So yeah, it came up to like 2,500. I was like, do I really want to spend 2,500 on this computer right now when my iMac is perfectly fine? You know what I'm saying? And plus I would be downgrading as far as the size because I think that is a 24 inch and my current iMac is a 27 inch. So, so yeah, I had, did have it pre-ordered, but I canceled it. Why wow, I like these though? This is cute. Clearly I don't like these. I like those. Any song that's thicker than a half inch. Um, <laughs> it's color. Right. This color, I like. Like, I would just wear all black of these. These are, oh, I'm about to see if they got these in my size. Those are cute. What are these? They say Jordan? Like, they just, um, okay <laughs> say hey y'all happy thursday so i'm on my way out the door it is 9 50. got some errands to run y'all seen yesterday me and cleveland went to the mall he couldn't find anything he did get the perfume the one million dollar or something like that perfume cologne so yeah it's just called one million paco rabane you think the e is pronounced i don't know paco rabane so. yeah paco rabane i don't know but um, yeah, one million. The uh, bottle was cute too. I know you don't care about the bottle. We twinning today. Uh, oh, I didn't know you had those on. Yeah, the bottle was um, nice. So I just got on my Tupac shirt. I think his birthday was a couple days ago. Yeah, and you know, some black yoga pants. And then I whipped out the 11s. Cleveland jocking. He kept jocking. <laughs> I have my shoes oh, you on said, you, nah, you was jocket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the 11s is just a vibe. I don't know why I don't wear them often. I got about five different 11s and um, don't even wear them. I think looking at the gym shoes yesterday, I need some earrings on. <laughs> Hold that thought. All right, that's better. Got on my shades, got on my earrings, and I'm gonna wear my little coach purse today. Like I said, I'm only gonna wear it as like a little. Um, top handle purse oops I gotta take the plastic tag off but I didn't really like it as a crossbody so now we in a Nike store and I'm trying to think if I should get these or not I don't know Cleveland trying on these you like them I like them I like them I don't know they're 109 so that's the thing I don't I don't want to pay 109 for these if these were maybe 60 it's always crowded in here but Cleveland did uh, get the shoes that he was trying on, but I put mine back. I ran into Kaylee. Uh, <laughs> She's so cute. You want to say anything? Shout out anybody? Um, follow my Instagram at Adore Kaylee, three O's, two E's. And uh, my favorite, they love Tamira underscore. They love underscore Tamira. We about to head back to Mall of Millennia because I didn't even, even show it yesterday. Oh, I thought you was talking about today. No, yeah, yesterday. I didn't even show them the shoes. But it was some shoes and journeys, Cleveland like. They didn't have the size and I looked it up online and um they got it at Mall of Millennia. So we didn't even go on journeys yesterday. So I got some shoes out of the Adidas store. Not over here though. We were somewhere else oh, before we came here. We were on international drive. Yeah, it's right on international drive right down the street, but um, it's the ones I got some shell toes, some Adidas shell toes. Let me show y'all real quick. I think these are so sweet. I've never really been into shell toes, even when they were popular back in the day. And I know they became um, that popular when somebody was wearing them. Who was it, Ariana Grande or somebody? I don't know, somebody brought them back and everybody was wearing them. I didn't care for them, but for some reason, today i was like oh i like these and i want every color i think these are so cute the white shell toe and black these are nice so i got those and i also got a, a bucket hat because mostly everything in it was 40 percent off it was the adidas outlet so i got the adidas bucket hat i want these we in 
journey, so I'm gonna wait and see if they got them in Foot Locker because I got like a twenty dollar off coupon, and these are eighty nine dollars. But if they don't have them in there, I may come back and get them. Got the shoes. I didn't get the Adidas because Finish Line didn't have them. Should I guess help I that lady or not? <laughs> yeah, it's this lady trying. She to, might get she it. Cause CC ain't going back far now. Look. She been trying to maneuver this big thing forever. <laughs> she in there thinking like... <laughs> oh, she trying to get out, not park. <laughs> she was trying to get out, not park. See, this truck is in the way. But anyway, um, yeah, I didn't get the Adidas because I really, I mean, I like them, but I'm like, do I want to pay $90 for them? But we about to go eat. It is 2.30, and the only thing I had was some Starbucks, of course. So we about to go try out this new crab or seafood place. It's called uh, King Crab or something like that. Mr. King Crab, that... <laughs> Wait, it should be right mm, where... Gianna pulling in, I guess. She in her car. I don't know if she leaving or... Where was that place at, though? Um, it's over... I it's right it. up in here somewhere. I don't know if Gianna coming or leaving. She's still in her car. But anyway, um, yeah. This uh, seafood place has been... Had a coming soon sign for about a year. Because of COVID. Yeah, because of COVID. And finally opened two weeks ago. We go go check it out. It's right over here near Mala Millennia. Oh my God. Hi. This is what it looks like. Like I said, the combos are preset and they're pretty simple. Uh, if you'd like something easy, you can definitely order it. But personally, I like building my own bag. That's you know where you have the most fun. Um, so on the back, we have our build the bag. Uh -oh. But it's gonna keep falling. This table, Javon, you hanging off? Oh, I didn't know it was yeah, that. It's the paper. Come on, focus. It ain't focusing. Be gonna turn it off and turn it back on. Yo, I think I done messed up my camera. <laughs> I'm not in focus, right? I had y'all sitting up on the napkin holder. <laughs> Can we even stop? I had y'all sitting up on the napkin holder and it dropped onto the table and this is what we got. So, hopefully Cleveland can help me. He acting stupid right now, so. But hopefully Cleveland can fix it because right now we, it's not. Now, if I zoom in, it works. What? No. <laughs> he fixed it. Now I need to decide what I'm gonna get. I don't want much, y'all, and honestly, I'm not even hungry. But since we were over here, I wanted to try this, even though we can easily come back over here. But Cleveland was hungry. We're probably just gonna get a cluster of cra uh, crab legs. I don't want no shrimp. They got some oysters. I don't feel like eating those right now. He said it come with corn and potatoes every time you get a pound. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, Listen. you're choosing two. Yeah. Right, so that's one pound. Right, okay. So yeah. you get corn and corn and potatoes. But if you get another pound or something, you get another corn and another potato. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. But you can mix and match. Yeah, and I don't still want whatever you get a pound. I just want, because I might get one, something over here. I might get the uh, catfish. I'll take the fried catfish, one cluster of crab legs, and a half a pound of mussels with the house sauce and a mouth. So one snow crab leg cluster and half a pound of mussels. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's coming with a corn and potato. Are we adding any extras? No. Mm -hmm. Oh, I do want, I want an egg. Yeah, I want a boiled egg. egg. Yeah. Um, here's the catfish and the fries, which was okay. And this is my bag. Like I said, I didn't get that much. I just got one cluster of snow crab, some eggs potato corn and mussels i can tell right now that the sauce is different it's a lot thicker 
you're not gonna like it. It's definitely different from the Juicy Crab. It's some kind of spice or seasoning. No, it, it's, this is a spice. I can't put my finger on it, but it's kind of weird tasting. Yeah. I want to say like coriander, you know, something like that. Something that I don't eat often. It's not nasty, but it's like when you start eating it, and then that, that spice come in later Overpowered. and it overpower everything. And also the muscle, green muscles, which is huge. And I usually get black muscles. I mean, it was good. Let me see. The corn is the same. See that spice come in and just hit you. It's not spicy, but... Mm. No, this is mild for sure. The flavor. Yeah, the flavor takes over. Like, that's all I'm tasting right now. Y'all yeah. know, another thing. I'm not getting like a butter sauce. Like, it's not like the typical butter sauce. And Cleveland mentioned it's like gravy, like a tomato based sauce, a tomato based gravy. <laughs> Come from living large, <laughs> living tall. Oops, sorry.